have not her samurai. How's it going, Radical viewers? Grim Gay, right back into a more Ghost of Tsushima. And, uh, I originally came here just to upgrade some stuff and, uh, check out this vanity gear I'm seeing. But, uh, I apparently missed something last time I was here. The Hot Spring Tutorial. Bathing in the Hot Springs restores your spirit. And, if you make a habit of it, the waters will grant you a long and prosperous life. I also need to reset my Elgato again because I'm hearing it pop and crackle in my ear. My apologies that's coming through, by the way, on your guys' end. The waters are warm and calming. But, uh, yeah. It happens from time to time if I keep the Elgato going for a while. I actually didn't do it, um... When I did, like, a damn near two-hour stretch of recording. Look at that ass. What am I reflecting on today? Clearing my mind. Stop thinking, Jen. For one moment, just stop thinking. No, mm. we're getting a lot of health increases, though. I, I honor your hot spring. Such an improvement. Surely you will triumph over our enemies. I feel ready to take on the whole Mongol army. Thank you. It was my pleasure. There are hot springs all over the island. Make use of them. Take time to heal and reflect. The practice will keep your body ready for battle, my lord. Cool. Also, I see flowers. I want those. And yoink. And... My lord, would that be the blade of Clan Sakai? Oh god, the resolve thing was here too? Oh crap. You know your swords. That is one worth knowing. I've heard tales of its sharp edge and beauty. But I never dreamed I'd see it in person. It has been some time since I trained on a bamboo stand. I would be honored to see your blade in action. <sighs> Hope you're not expecting much. I'm gonna grab this real quick before I fail at this entirely. Okay. Okay. It's going better already. Damn it. Got the last one. Damn it. I was doing so well. Ah, oh, so close. Damn it. That last one gets me every time. Yeah, there we go. It's getting easier. It's getting there. Oh. That's disheartening. <laughs> the Sakai steel is a truly fine blade, wielded by an even finer swordsman. But training with bamboo will only make you stronger. I'll need strength for what lies ahead. There are bamboo stands throughout the island. They will help sharpen your skills on the journey. Farewell, my lord. <sighs> you know, I gotta say, out of everything I've seen in this game so far, the one definitive thing I'm probably not really digging on, but I can definitely appreciate nonetheless, is the uh, how do we increase your resolve with the bamboo sands? Come, oh, my lord. Crap. The story of Uchitsune awaits. I came here to upgrade stuff. Damn it. <laughs> Shit. There's gotta be. I I need to find the merchants and stuff first, man. Like. Don't get me wrong, I really appreciate all this stuff. I'll come back to that. We're probably going to do that today. But I 
I, I came here for vanity stuff, dude. I didn't come here for all this other stuff I didn't realize was here. Grand, now that I know it's here, I'm really thankful, because holy crap. Oh, there we go. Yeah, and there's some supplies right there. Not really, but I'll take it. 300 supplies and 15... Wait, hold up. Because I also want to check the vanity stuff. And honestly, I don't use the bow too awful often. And even when I do get the other bow, I'm not going to use it too awful often. Awful often, awful often. Gotta say that six times fast. Ooh, awful often. Are you the guy I want to talk to you about the vanity stuff? All my goods are useful. Some recent acquisitions here. Oh. Uh, that's okay. Yeah, I don't like that. I do like that. What else do I got? I don't even have that. I do have this. Whoa. I don't know. I kind of legit like the default look, if I'm being honest. Um, I do want this, though, because I, I was saying I want this in red. Yes. I, I, I've been wanting... Ooh. <laughs> That's handy. I also need to frickin'... Yeah, that is far better already. Hey, Biz, look, I'm Kung Lao. <laughs> okay, uh... There's even more flowers here. Jesus Christ. Is there anything here I need to be aware of before I go tackle the uh, mythic thing? I can talk to you. Lord Sakai, yes. after you cleared the bridge, we headed straight here. Oh, you're those guys. How's the boy? Better, my lord. The hot springs are helping him forget. Okay, thank you. Anything in here I'm going to want to snag? Yep, linen. I like how everyone just gets up and bows. I mean, I am Lord Sakai. I am I am literally the descendant of the Lord of uh, Tsushima, currently. So, I guess it's to be expected. Okay, uh, let's mark that mythic guy. There we go. Because that's probably going to be our goal today. Because that, uh, those, those give you wicked stuff. That, that gave me a new, a new sword move that, uh, they kind of hit and miss, frankly, but it's pretty cool. And who knows, in the future, I might get something really badass. Can I check in here first? One moment. Oh, I found another record. And supplies! That... Okay, that was a candle I saw. Alright. Yeah, tell me. Long ago, an emperor and his palace were plagued by a winged demon. The Emperor sent for Uchitsune, the most renowned archer of his time, who wielded a bow blessed by Akami. When the demon next came, Uchitsune was ready, long bow in hand. His aim was truer, and his arrows flew farther than any archers in Japan. Uchitsune loosed a single arrow. It pierced the demon's heart, as it fell to the ground, it cursed Uchitsune with its final breath. Soon after, Uchitsune saw the forms of the demon everywhere. His legendary bow never missed, but each arrow that hit its mark was met with a very human scream. The trail of bodies led to his capture. Though many called for Uchitsune's death, the Emperor felt pity for him. Uchitsune was banished to Tsushima Island. He died years later, alone and forgotten by all but a few. The demon-slaying Longbow has remained hidden here since his passing, 
Some say it awaits a worthy master. Others believe it still holds the demon's curse. Huh. I guess we're getting the longbow now. <laughs> I'm fine with that, actually, because I... The bow sounds powerful. Take care, my lord. The bow inspires darkness in those who seek it. I'll bear that in mind. The question is where to begin looking. To quiet his mind, Uchitsune often walked the coast, obsessed with the blue hydrangeas that grew there. Perhaps they'll provide a clue. Interesting. Yeah, legit though, I do appreciate this far more. Uh, okay, am I done with the yellow bird thing? Is that it? Golden bird? There's someone that wants to talk to me in here, damn it. Hello. Forgive me, my lord, but you look fatigued. Have kind you of. endured much hardship? A little bit. You wouldn't believe it if I told you. Legit. But yes, I could use a rest. You should visit my sister in Hiyoshi Springs. I was sick, so she insisted I bathe in the waters. I could feel the life returning to my body. Sounds like just what I need. Hiyoshi Springs. Have I been there already? Where am I currently? Okay, yeah, I've already been here. Okay, whatever, yeah. There's a trapper here too, but apparently I don't actually have enough for an upgrade, which makes me a little sad. Coast. He said the coast. I'm digging this hat, though. I gotta visit an armorsmith, though, and upgrade the crap out of this, because uh, I think this is going to be as good of a stealth set as I'm going to find for a minute. Did I see a glow? I did see a glow. Look at that. Look at my sharp eyes. Can't spot a frickin' Mongol archer to save my life, but my god, can I spot a frickin' tree hiding behind a rock? I have weird priorities. Hmm? Okay, yep. Nope, I did see a flower. Blue hydrangeas, like the musician mentioned. I must be close. Bam! Okay, his eyes caught it before I did, because I... Oh, yeah, dead bodies. It's always a good sign. Oh, I'm, I'm legit blind. They... <clears throat> so he must come up here. Hmm. Oh, God, that music. Mmm. Mm. Man. For real though, screw anyone that says this game sucks. This game is damn gorgeous, it's damn beautiful in so many different freaking ways. Oh, there we go. There's more over there. Let's check this out real quick. I just want to make sure... Uh... Okay, yeah, there's nothing here. I could literally just run around this game for hours and never be bored of it. Okay. That's a dead man. That's worrisome. It's also a dead man. Okay, I'm still in the area. There's more of them. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. Hello? Do you lead someone? Hmm. Nope. 
Apparently you're just there for the sake of being there. I also see a flower in the distance. Gonna go grab that real quick. <sighs> this might be a minute. The fact the game uses a f the flowers as currency, that is interesting to me. Hmm. Freaking for a legendary longbow! You know, on that note, I wonder, like... No, this has to be like a natural progression thing, and I just completely skipped over it. Because I I just kind of popped into Hiyoshi Hot Springs, and I, I didn't think twice about... What was that? I heard something. That yeah, probably nothing. But no, yeah, I literally just dipped in and uh, kind of dipped out because it's like, okay, I think I... Oh, Strange. okay, I found it. Tomb is cracked open. Yep, we're gonna pay that a visit right after I snag this. But no, seriously, using flowers is currency. Like when the game developer said that you grab flowers to make dyes, I figured like you have to grab like the specific colors of flowers to make the dyes for outfits and gear. I didn't know it was just like you use it as a currency. This is nice. An island surrounded by blue flowers. Which is in this bowl could be there. Hmm. Which is in this resting place. You are legit gonna have me look for that, aren't you? Okay. Oh. Hmm. There go my dogs again. Yep. Okay. Every time I hit record, they're gonna bark eventually. Just cause they gotta hear a squirrel or something chittering outside. Searching for the cursed bow. It leads only to death. Eat my dick. He wore the mask of a Tengu demon. And that was a warning shot. Can't let my guard down. Well, I really hope I can get his mask, because honestly that sounds amazing. I really appreciate the fact this game uses the touchpad like it does. Like, I mean, Grant, I don't have too many PS4 games, but the few I do don't really utilize the touchpad to a degree I would like. Let's see if I can sneak up on this guy and get a chain off. Nope. Oh, uh, smoke bomb. Nope. Okay. Well, in that case... Family's home on the Kashine shore. The Mongols turned it into a shipyard. They must be repairing their ships, getting ready for their next conquest. Stay away from there until I've killed them all. How kind. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, back to what we were doing. We're looking for an island. And if I was going to take a guess, I think I see it right down there. God damn. Look at all this crap. 
Look at this. I'm rich, biatch! Rich in pollen. <laughs> Kind of feel bad now because I actually spent a lot of these videos asking for people's suggestions on how they want me to proceed in this game. And uh, I've kind of been recording so much so fast that I'm not going to be able to actually see what y'all are suggesting. I feel bad about that. But honestly, this is a hard game to actually just stop playing and put down. Hmm. I think. Unless there's another island over here I'm missing, but no, I don't think... That is not what I meant to press. Okay, yeah, it's one of those down there. It has to be. Which is going to be fun to get to because, uh... Wait, was that... Ooh, there is a bridge. Okay, that might be... That might be my ticket. Might be my ticket. God, even this game at night looks freaking beautiful. Look at that. This game, man. This freaking game. Mmm. Mmm. I like how a lot of this is just me either doing fantastic in combat, sucking at combat, doing halfway decent in stealth, screwing up stealth, and just kicking freaking butt after that. And the rest of it is just me gushing over how pretty it is, or how fantastic it looks, you know? How the hell? Oh, wait, a note. That's a shrine. Damn it, I want that too. Well, I gotta get down there... Oh, crap. Really? Now? Now? Alright. I'm lucky you'll just lead me to a hot spring or something. Oh, that actually legit looks like you're leading me to a hot spring, actually. Yeah, I can follow that path to the shrine. I swear to God, I don't mean to do it this way, but it seems like we're constantly finding um, a bird, a fox, a bird or a fox, which leads us to something cool. Uh, doing a weird side thing and then doing kind of a main-ish thing. Alright. I thought I'd complain because, hey, health upgrade. And again, I love and appreciate how you find all this so naturally in the game. All it takes is a little bird or a fox just kind of pointing you in the right direction. My code. No, not my code because I'm trying to forget that because that's why we lost. Even look at the detail on the shadow on his chest. God. Really, when it comes to the graphics, the only thing I'm, I can actually find a nitpick on is maybe the water? But hell, I've seen far worse water detail in some games. Alright, let's see if I can get down here safely. From a glance? Yes, I can. Though I could have probably just ran back and gone to the Shinto Shrine. Oh. More blue flowers. Oh, I think the bow is at the Shinto Shrine. That's handy. <laughs> so, did I already find something at Shinto Shrine that wasn't a charm of some kind? I may have. I just can't remember because I've been going through this so quickly, it's hard to remember that stuff. Mending Rock Shrine. Sanctuary of the Kami of Medicine. Okay, no. So this isn't gonna... Be that. Oh. God. Uh... I'm open to suggestions. Oh, here we go. I just need to keep looking, and voila, I'll find it. Okay, that leap. Oop, what was that? Okay. And jump. 
The platforming is actually really good. But I gotta be careful, because the last time I said that, that's when it went from really good to really bad. Also, I cannot see for crap. There we go. Pulse fails. Assume the way is forward. I'm sorry, I think this is not the actual way for the bow, but... Dang it, maybe it is, too. Uh... Wait, what? Ah, okay. I was say, wait a minute. Maybe I should look up. <sighs> That's gonna be fun. Okay, I'm good. Okay, then I'll just go down, 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 left. Getting back is going to be interesting. Hmm. Probably shouldn't do that right now, but I also want that really bad. There's nothing this way, is there? Nope. Um... Okay, so that's going to lead me to try and That's not even going to be the right spot for the bow, so we're going to keep going a little bit longer. Yeah, the... I'm not sure I can make this, but I'm going to try... Oh, boy. Oh, my God. This game really likes keeping you on your toes with that crap. Okay. And up. Down and down and down and leap. Hmm. Huh. Fun fact, I hate heights still. Mm. This crap makes me cringe. Uh, okay. How safe would you all feel if you had to traverse something like this just to pay your respects to your gods, the dead, and all that? Because, uh, frankly, I kind of I, I think about changing my religion at this point. Can I shoot the birds when I think about it? Frog. Flower. Yoink. Okay. Come on. Okay, that scared me. Oh, there's another flower. Yoink. Okay. Almost there. Yep. That looks safe. Okay. Yep. Yeet. Yo. Woo. Honor the shrine. What charm did I get from this? Okay, Nushi. What does that do? Oh, yo. What I currently have. Uh, deal bonus damage, what, 50% less? Yeah, screw that. I kind of like healing outside of combat. So that way, uh, I don't have to keep pressuring myself to heal whenever I'm, uh, just at the end of a fight, I can just say, okay, I'll heal naturally and I'll be fine. Of course, I could just trade him out at the end, couldn't I? Like, after a fight, I could just trade out one charm for another. So I can actually just heal that way. I could do that. Okay, um...
I'm not going that way. Okay. Fall the flowers, Gaddy. Fall the flowers. Let me see this again. Hmm. I keep wanting to make some pretty broad assumptions about some of the things in this game. Like, uh... Example, it gets more apparent you're on the right path if you pay attention to, like, the foliage... Foliage... The plant life around you. Example, I'm supposed to be following frickin' uh, blue flowers. Well, maybe if I followed it to the thicker spots is where I'll need to be. Okay, that's the only I thought it was. It wasn't that. That's it. I think it's down there. It's gotta be one of those. Right? I mean, it's literally just a small island off the beach. Okay, I'm so happy I got that damn roll. Hello, flower. I almost didn't see because you would sparkle right when you're behind a tree. That rhymed. Eh. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wanna do a no commentary playthrough for the Kurosawa playthrough, you know? At the same time though, I feel like um, a lot of the audio that I appreciate will be kind of absent from that because it is Kurosawa mode and but the few things I gather from a couple of reviews, um, it does kind of nix a lot of the really good ambient audio. But, I mean, that's the point, right? It's all black and white Japanese filming. So, it makes sense that way. And also, I think I found my island. And I was kind of right. The denser the blue flowers were... Uh... Okay, I actually might be right in my little assumption there. Yeah, look at this. Jesus. That's brilliant. I'm so happy they did it that way. You know you're on the right path if you see more and more of what you should see. Big brain. I has big brain! Oh, well, that looks like my island. How do I get to it? I can swim, right? We established this, right? That, that's a thing? Okay. I don't know where I heard you can't swim in this game from. Um, I heard it somewhere. Also, that dude in the Tengu mask is probably going to be around here somewhere. You're kidding. A mountain surrounded by blue flowers. Richardson's boat could be there. I am seeing a pattern. I'm gonna get shot at again, aren't I? Continue How do I know? Search, and Tsushima will fall. Enough. Speak plainly. This is your last chance. Leave the ball alone. Eat my dick. Yeah, I want Lombo. Yeah, I, I, I kind of almost wish they made the touchpad just a little smaller. You know. Okay. Now here's my next question: Does it want me to follow the shoreline, or does it want me to go back up? That's really the only time I kind of question the uh, be guided by the wind function of this game. Is that sometimes it doesn't seem readily apparent what direction you really should take. Because, I mean, that's kind of half the point, isn't it? I mean, a lot of this game is you explore. Is that a yellow bird? I hope it wasn't. I don't have time for your shit today, bird. Legit. I... There, there was no actual point to coming up here, was there? Nope. 
Okay. Okay, uh, back up the trail we go then. I mean, it's a bloody mountain, right? So it should be inland. I'm just happy Jin can swim, frankly. <sighs> Where am I at for time? Granted, every time I check the time now, I'm... Wow, never mind. I am way over, I thought. I was. Okay, hopefully there's not a boss fight at the end of this, because there is... Oh, dear sweet lord, this video is going to take a day and a half to upload. Ugh. The joys of being a YouTuber with crappy internet, kids. Don't do it. Like, you want to know why most of my videos are only 30 minutes at best, like, on average all the time, or if not less, that's why. Because I can at least upload a 30-minute video in less than a day. The moment I hit twice that, oh, no, 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 no. It takes me freaking forever and a half to get that crap uploaded. Which is annoying. And again, I'm also not abusing the fact I have a freaking horse. Because I am the dumb. I am true gamer. I have big brain moment, then I have very, very small brain moment. Did I see something? I might have. If I did, I missed it. Oh well. I'm on a schedule now, damn it. Screw it. Stand and fight. Screw it. I like standoffs. Ooh, I get to take a shield guy out first. Now I'm getting smoke. I forgot. Smoke bombs. Swap back to those real quick, just in case. Alright, and we'll free you. You'll be free soon. I'm in the middle of something, by the way, so you're welcome. I could have just ran right past you. Go somewhere safe. I thought I had. <clears throat> I made myself a camp along the river that separates Azamo from Tutu. The Mongols moved in and started cutting down all the trees. Uh, making siege weapons, I think. I'll find their logging camp. And make sure they never finish their work. I keep hearing about Sutsu here. And uh, I'm starting to think I'm going to end up there one way or the other. Where's my damn horse? Oh. <laughs> well. Oh. But. That's not. Okay, whatever. You know what? Whatever. I'll take it. Legit thought that was my horse under my feet when I called it. It's like, I'm just whistling my dead horse. I feel so terrible now. <laughs> oh, God, that scared the crap out of me. It's like... This... Wait. This is where I found Sniper Sensei? Yeah, this is where we... Me and Sniper Sensei freaking dealt with all that crap. Let's say, I thought this area looked familiar. I'm not gonna lie, guys, just the rest of my throat and the fact that I don't really want to talk over some of the ambient sound here. I might very well just start shutting up and y'all will just enjoy it with me. Because a lot of this game I find and I'm very appreciative of is it has those high intensity moments of combat and all that, but it also. crap. As annoying moments where you're trying to just get from point A to point B and then the damn bird shows up. <laughs> Let me guess.
Okay, never mind. I actually don't know. Uh, one moment, bird. I'll get to you. I just want to check this out. Glad I did, because there's supplies in here. This is going to be a longer video. I hate myself. I came out here for a damn bow. How's a dojo here? Oh, God damn it! I can just fast travel here. God damn it, bird. We'll probably tackle him next. Do more of his stuff. Cause there's the side quests aren't just like one and done things. They're constant things. Okay, mountain, flowers. That's probably the first time I heard an authentic audio bug. <laughs> or at least the one I was able to pick up on. Wait, this... I think I've been here before. No, I legit think I've been here before, but the bow wasn't here then. I guess I need to pick it up, huh? Well, there's the bow now. Yo, what's happening? What happened? Am I dead? Where am I? The ball is cursed. You will see nothing but death to the end of your days. Crap. <laughs> Okay. I don't know what time it is. What time is it? Okay. Alrighty. Do you not fear the demon's curse? First, nope. drive the Mongols from our home. After that, I'll worry about curses. You see? The demon will haunt you. Sure it will. I'm getting better. I say as I die in a flock of frickin' ravens. Am I dead? No, I'm not dead. The curse of Uchitsune. The hell was that about? <laughs> Do I got the bow now, though? Do I have the bow? Tell me I have the bow. False fails, I leveled up. What am I now? The Unyielding Wind. And my maximum resolve is increased. Nice. Oh, my health. Okay, what am I grabbing next? Uh, sticky Bomb. Wind Chime. Definitely Wind Chime. That way I don't have to do my... Uh... These chimes can be a distraction. Or lure. Or worse. I have no technique points, and I'm sad because of that. But... I need to go upgrade this. I'll probably do that uh, in between recordings here. I do have a longbow now, though. So what are th what are they like the key differences? Damage, obviously. Draw speed is down. The range is the same. Wow, that's upgraded too. Okay. Stability. Reload speed. Zoom. Okay. Okay, interesting. Cannot crouch while aiming. Okay.
Oh, you don't say. <laughs> Hold L2. Oh, yo! Okay. Interesting. Huh. That's really freaking cool. I'm not too... Actually, no, I am a fan of it, because it actually matches my scabbards. Oh, that's cool. Anyway, guys, that's it for uh, this video. Um, 45 minutes, damn it. As usual, I hope you all enjoyed. If you all did enjoy, greatly showing that support, as always, by liking the video, subscribe to the channel, and, of course, sharing it with your friends. And tuning in to see what happens next, uh, either tomorrow or the day after. I'm going hard on this game. I really am. Hold on, mighty. But once again, thank you all for watching, and as usual, cheers to those that love us, the losers that lost us, and as always, lucky sons of bitches that get to meet us. And we will catch you all in the next video. See you then.